We present TinyMPC, a high-speed and low-memory footprint solver for model predictive control targeting the microcontrollers commonly found on small robots. Model predictive control is a powerful tool for controlling robotic systems subject to complex constraints, but is computationally demanding. Many robotic platforms have limited compute power, and in general, the smaller they are, the less they have, while at the same time requiring faster control loops to stabilize their higher speed dynamics. TinyMPC was designed around the premise of bringing model predictive control to these highly resource-constrained platforms, but of course will work on anything more powerful as well. At the heart of our solver is the alternating direction method of multipliers, or ADMM, which has been derived in prior works. The algorithm alternates between solving three sets of variables, the primal, slack, and dual, until convergence. Solving the linear system in the primal update is the most expensive part of each ADMM iteration. By exploiting the MPC problem structure, this step becomes the solution to an LQR problem, where K and D are the optimal feedback gain and feedforward term for a given time step, and are computed using Riccati recursion. Given a long enough horizon, the Riccati equations converge to the solution of the infinite horizon LQR problem, which is a single gain matrix K infinity and cost to go Hessian P infinity. We save on memory by caching just these two matrices instead of the entire horizon of Ks and Ps. Only the linear terms of the Riccati equation need to be updated as part of each ADMM iteration. And because we already calculated P and K, we can also pre-compute the matrix inverse and other matrix coefficients. The result is an algorithm whose most expensive operations are matrix vector products, allowing TinyMPC to achieve a low memory footprint while performing fast online computations. Our algorithm is capable of solving the MPC problem almost an order of magnitude faster than OSQP, and with a far smaller memory footprint unlocking the ability to run model predictive control algorithms on highly resource-constrained microcontrollers. We demonstrate our algorithm's real-world efficacy by implementing it on the CrazyFly 2.1, a nano-quad rotor with limited RAM and processing speed. We compare it against three of the CrazyFly's built-in controllers by tracking a figure-eight trajectory at two different speeds. The first had a period of six seconds, and all four controllers had low tracking error. The second, larger figure-eight, had a period of three seconds, and tiny MPC had the lowest tracking error. We then tested recovery from an extreme initial pose using the same four controllers. TinyMPC and two of the built-in controllers were able to recover from a 90 degree pitch. However, only TinyMPC guaranteed feasible controls throughout the entire process. TinyMPC allows us to perform dynamic obstacle avoidance on board the robot and in real time. On the left, we relinearize the sphere at the end of the moving stick into hyperplane constraints over the horizon at every time step. On the right, we show the crazy fly avoiding the end of the stick with the additional constraint of the vertical YZ plane. With TinyMPC, we bring model predictive control to computationally underpowered robots, giving them the ability to perform complex maneuvers in real time. Thank you for watching.